Next into the tank are Janet and her auntie Annie. They're hoping their unique gadget will tease a deal from a shark. We think that this product is going to be so successful and change so many women's lives. It does have a huge potential to go global. Yeah, I totally agree. <laughs> Hi everyone, my name is Janet and this is my auntie and business partner, Annie. And we are HTZ Hair Revolution and we have a product to show you today which is called the HTZ Hot Teas. Our product is about making hair more voluminous. It works by giving texture to the roots of the hair. It's a heated hair appliance, it's very easy to use, and it's a fantastic, fast and efficient tool. It's been designed um, by Anne herself, who is an experienced hairdresser. Basically, it's used for hair like mine, uh, which would be like that without it. It gives a little bit of texture to the base of the roots. It's not like a crimping iron. A crimping iron is a V shape. It has little square shapes, which is four points of crease instead of two points of crease, which makes it denser and less noticeable. And in my 50 years of hairdressing, nothing has ever given me, because it's very thin, nothing has given me hair that I can go like that and it will just still have body and that's what I've been looking for. What we are looking for from a shark is $500,000 for 5%. Jesus. Your request was for $500,000 for 5% valuing your business at $10 million. Wow. Is that correct? That's serious. Yes. That's, that's big and we look forward to seeing it. So would you like to demonstrate your product so yes. that we can see it? Can I do somebody's head? Would you sure. Like? It's been the, the long, thick hair. Do you get your hair done very often lately or what? Every day. My hair's not going to fall out, is it? <laughs> no. Janet, can I just clarify something? Is this a replacement for a, a curling iron or a hair straightener or is it something completely different? Well, we designed this as a volumizer, and that was solely what it was meant to be. But you can also do your ribbon curls and everything, much like a hair straightener. What are you spraying into our roots? Uh, hair remover. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so with this root lift spray is a light hairspray. So does this come with the product? It comes with a 60ml version of the root lift spray, which is actually manufactured here in Australia. It doesn't actually feel like it's got anything in it. <laughs> it's a bit scary, isn't it? Oh, dear. Okay, no, Let's that is... get a... Uh... <laughs> Fire extinguisher. Quick, a fire blanket. Bring a fire blanket. <laughs> I can see smoke. So I'm sizzling. There is smoke coming off your head. It's just that I'm not going to wait for the spray to dry. All hot irons do that if you have wet spray. <laughs> Don't laugh. Stop laughing. <laughs> can't take you seriously, sorry, Janine. I couldn't take you seriously before getting your hair done. Now getting your hair done, I can't take you seriously at all. What do you sell them for? Okay, online we sell them at 245. We are trying to encourage people to come and see us at our pop-up shops and our expos and all that sort of thing. So when we do something like that, we do a promo price of 195. So a 10 million dollar valuation. So what are your sales to date? Sales to date is 208. 208 units. So then how do you justify the $10 million valuation? So, well, what we've done is with each pop-up shop, we have sold lots and we've made our money back. Hang on. Lots. Lots? You've only sold 208. I'm shocked. $10 million valuation is complete garbage. Janet and Annie have invented a gadget that gives hair more volume. But as Janine's locks get bigger, so do the holes in Janet and Annie's business model. So a $10 million valuation, so what are your sales to date? Sales to date is 208. So then how do you justify the $10 million valuation? I'm shocked. 10 million bucks and you got nothing. You're 208 sales. You're going to be doing pop-up shops the rest of your life to try and justify a $10 million valuation. 
I just don't understand how I can invest in something which has, you know, you've sold 208 of these and we don't have a business plan and it's a $10 million valuation. It's sort of a bit cheeky, don't you think? Who, where or what has this valuation come from? Did you do it or did you get help with the valuation? I did get help from uh, my friend who's an accountant. Oh God, get a new accountant. So he's basing that on what we assume we'll be doing at... We've got three expos booked for this year already. Janet, he's a bloody idiot. To give you a valuation of $10 million to come into the tank, and you know, you've watched this show, you knew we weren't going to be happy. Yeah, but look how I look. Isn't it worth it? <laughs> I have to say, Janine looks amazing. Do I look like I'm back to the 80s? She looks like Wonder Woman. It's... <laughs> That's what she reminds me of. It's Wonder Woman. It... No, it's, it's voluminous. No, yeah. It's good. It's good. Thank you very much. It's amazing. <laughs> what do you think, Glenn? Oh, it looks great. Annie and, and, and Janet, look, um, I'm not your ideal customer for this sort of thing. I don't quite understand what it is. I think you need to seriously look at that $10 million valuation you've stuck in there, because I think you'll come unstuck on that today. I'm out. I, I wish you all the best. Thank you. I, I must admit, it does bother me watching my daughters go and, and go, I'm waiting for the hair to fall out. Hair's very resilient, believe me. Um, I'm worried about the $10 million valuation. Whoever helped you with that has done you a massive disservice. Uh, I'm out. Thank you. You need to work with a company that will make and distribute this for you locally and globally. That's the way to go, not selling it at pop-up stores. And the other thing is, change your accountant, because whoever gave you the $10 million valuation in a way set you up to fail today. I'm sorry, I wish you luck. You've got a product, keep going, but it's not an investment for me. I'm out. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Do you know what I love about you two? Most people talk about doing something and you've done it. You have bought a product to market. However, you're playing in a very big, scary ocean with big competitors. I'm out. Thank you. Thank you. You know what, you've come up with a great idea, but you're not necessarily business people, and that's okay. Either was I when I started, I had to learn. So tick, exposure, tick. You've got a great product, well done. And you're passionate about it, and it's you love it. But the $10 million valuation means it's uninvestable. I'm sorry, I'm out. Okay. Thank you. Thanks for the hair. <laughs> you're welcome. <laughs> Thank you, ladies. Thank you very much. Thanks, Janet. Thanks, Annie. I think the root lift spray is amazing. Look at that. It's amazing. It's over. <laughs> we did our best. Yeah. Plan A. Plan A. Back to plan A. I think if your husband was watching now, he'd be <laughs> very keen to see you, darling. What are you, Mon <laughs> Oh, you look like that. It's, it's amazing. <laughs>